may have the number one or one of your former players may be the number one overall draft pick. And the odds are right now looking like it could be Bryce Young. How important, I mean, you you obviously sell the NFL as part of your recruiting pitch. Does it help to have the number one overall draft pick when you're out there recruiting uh, a kid that might want to come play quarterback at Alabama? Well, I don't think there's any question about the fact that the last three quarterbacks we have have had at Alabama are all starters in the league, including Jalen. And Bryce may be, you know, the first guy picked in the draft. I think all those things are, you know, selling points to guys that want to have a career and develop a career you know, really at any position, but especially the quarterback position. It, you know, speaks volumes of the sort of offense that we've had that is quarterback friendly and uh, the receivers that we've also had that uh, have been very successful as well. So uh, we're excited for Bryce. Uh, We're certainly hopeful that, you know, everything works out for him. I don't think there's any question about the fact that most people agree that, um, you know, he was the most productive guy you know, in the draft at that position, but, you know, they all take size and all that kind of stuff into consideration. So, you know, hopefully uh, it's not where you get picked in a draft though. It's really what kind of career you have. And he's the kind of guy that whatever happens in this is he's going to be very dedicated to trying to be the best player he can be. He played at one of the best high school programs in the history of high school football. Basically the first time you saw him on tape, did he did, I mean, was I don't know if you look at tape this way. It's probably what you're going to tell me. But did, <laughs> did you look at him and say, that kid could be the number one overall pick one day? Um, I don't look at tape that way. I knew you were going to say that, yeah. And, it, you know, it's it's so hard to say because we, we don't have the opportunity to evaluate the other players. You know, when you're in the league, which I was in the league for eight years, you have the opportunity to evaluate all the players so you can make comparisons. But it's very difficult to make those comparisons when – you're just looking at your players and especially when you look at a high school player because i think the most important thing i try to we try to get our high school guys re- regardless of what position is to focus on their development you know they all want to be first round draft picks someday but what do you have to do to do it um and what are you willing to sacrifice to be able to do it and how can you stay focused on not the outcome but what you have to do to get the outcome and i think that's the most important thing and you know, Bryce did an outstanding job of that, and uh, a lot of our players have been rewarded very well for, I think we had like something like 70 players on NFL rosters last year, so we're, we're proud of that, and it does help in recruiting. 